Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the another video. Apple released the iOS 18 beta 3 instead of beta 4 and also there is no public update yet while I'm showing this video. In this video, I'm going to talk about why beta 3 is re-released again. So let's start this video. So if you want to install this update, what you need to do is simply go to settings, go to general, go to software update and over here you will see the update. Since the beta 3 is out, checking for updates is taking a lot of time. It wasn't supposed to take this much time, but now it is taking a lot of time. I am not sure why it is taking. Over here, the iOS 18 beta 3 update will pop up. Now let's talk about why there is beta 3 again and not uh, public beta 1 or developer beta 4. So before talking about that, last year Apple releases iOS 17 developer beta 3 and after a couple of days they released the iOS 17 developer beta 3 again that was also re-released and after that day they released the first public beta of the iOS 18. So Apple is following those steps once again. Over here they released the iOS 18 developer beta 3 again. If I show you the build number over here, the build number is 22A5307F and the build number of the iOS 18 beta 3 re-released is quite different. So if I go to show you over, show you that, the new build number is 22A5307I. Now what Apple trying to do is tomorrow, hopefully, or maybe this week, they will release the iOS 18 public beta 1 and the purpose of releasing the iOS 18 developer beta 3 is the both versions, the public beta 1, also the 18 beta 3 will have the same build number. So this is the purpose of iOS 18 beta 3 re-release. Apple want to give them both same build number because both will contain almost same, not almost, actually exactly same feature. So this is why Apple released iOS 18 developer beta 3. There is nothing new in this version. It is same as it was before with the beta 3, but it is here. And the update size, if I show you over here, over here, as you can see, the update size is quite small. It is just 360 MBs. Definitely also it depends upon your iPhone. It may be different for you. But this is the only reason that why Apple releases iOS 18 developer beta 3. I hope the thing's been cleared for you that why there is 18 developer beta 3 again and not the public beta 1. So we are expecting to see public beta 1 following this week. That may be going to be tomorrow, maybe on 16th of July. Definitely, I will, be, I will update you guys with that too. Well, that's it from this video. I hope you liked it. If you did, give this video a big thumbs up. Do like and share this video. Subscribe to my channel. If I want to show you that many people are not subscribing to the channel, I'm not sure why. If I go to the studio or here audience, I want to show you the section where if I'm able to find it, as you can see, I'm not sure where it is. Watch time from subscribers because you can see subscribe is just 5.2% while not subscribed is 94.8%. So make sure to subscribe. See you in the next video.